Hi, this is Carol and welcome to my studio. I named this painting Pineapple. How to Paint Loose Shapes in Freeform Abstract 5. As we move along in this painting, I'm going to be giving you some steps that you could follow to create your own abstract. And always remember to try very hard to keep your imagination wide open. I prepared my canvas with heavy gel and the gesso blended together, used cellophane wrap, pulled it off and let it dry. Now I'm putting on my first coat of the background of the painting in which I'll be blending my colors. And I started using a medium gray and a color that I made up with dark brown and some red added to it. it the majority of the colors in this painting are on the warm side and I will be coming in with a dash of the cool colors for my accent. At the same time that I'm putting on my blended base colors, I'm going to start adding in lines that are going to be the format of my shapes. I'm basically doing triangles. Now you could add squares or circles to this if you'd like. But as you can see, my colors and my forms are starting to take place. My technique is to use color balanced harmony and that's why I'm putting in my dark gray forms in the center of the painting. And I'll also be layering that in on both left and right sides of the painting for my balance. And I do like to go back and forth on the canvas with my various colors. It gives the paint time to dry so I can come back and put another layer on as I go along. Here's a trivia question. Why did I name this painting Pineapple? Well, I didn't name it until the very end and I was selecting my songs and I listened to this one song called Tropical and I just, boom, thought of a pineapple. So there you are, the color yellow. I do like the colors I'm using in this painting. I know when it's finished, it's going to be very bright and light with the interesting forms. Okay, we'll sit back and watch me paint now and I'll continue to lay in various forms. I do blend in my light gray throughout this painting that really does tone down any brassness in this painting and it goes so nicely with the yellow and the orange.
here I'm putting in my Brilliant Violet. And I will be using my Color Harmony here and there throughout the canvas with the Violet. As I continue blending throughout this painting, I get more definite with my forms. And I even start laying in some dark colored forms. This is mainly to bring them out, to give it more of a 3D dimensional look in the finished painting. Not to say that you always have to have a dark area in your painting, but in this particular one, I chose that I did want some dark paint. And on some of the areas of the dark forms, I will come back pretty soon and start laying in with the spatula, some titanium white, as you can see, I'm just doing it right now. I'm putting it here and there, and I will even go over the dark form with it. That will actually lighten it up and just make my painting a little more interesting. When you do that, you're actually also adding softness to your painting. And as you can see with your forms, just because you start a form, you don't have to feel that it's finished midway or at the end of the painting. You could always add on to that form and continue adding something a little bit more dramatic.
For the finishing touches for my Color Harmony painting, I add in a light turquoise blue, some cobalt blue, a little cyan blue, and I use a spatula with that application. These various color of blues will make the painting pop. It just makes it totally more interesting. And again, you've got the lighter values in the background, and in the foreground, you have the darker values. This is my painting pineapple in natural lighting. And this is pineapple on the wall under a spotlight. Following are close-ups of this painting so you can see my brush strokes and the strokes with the palette knife. And I want to thank you again so very much for visiting me. And please like and comment and subscribe so you'll get notification of my next paintings. My subscribe button is at the end of this video. Thank you.